Hi everybody, Dr. Mike here. In this video, we're gonna take a look at the role of the cardiac system. First important point is that the heart is a specialized type of muscle, and like all muscle, it contracts to generate some sort of force. Now the force that the heart generates is a force that pushes or ejects blood out to deliver oxygen and nutrients to the tissues of the body. We call this a pressure. And we often measure this pressure in millimeters of mercury. Now when the heart contracts to eject this blood, the term we use is systole. So systole, let's write that up. Systole is the contraction of the heart to eject that blood. Then, after a contraction, the heart needs to relax and fill up with blood, and this is what we call diastole. So diastole is the relaxation or filling of the heart. Now the heart itself is located in our chest. It's a little bit bigger than the size of our fist, and it sits a little bit towards the left of the sternum, the middle portion of our chest. It's also tilted a little bit, so that the pointy bottom of the heart that we term the apex is actually pointing towards our left hip. That's probably an important point to highlight. So the apex is pointing towards the left hip. Now this apex is sitting at around about the space between the fourth and fifth rib, what we call the fourth intercostal space. Fourth intercostal space. Now the top of the heart, strangely enough, is called the base. And so the base of the heart sits at around about the third rib. And this is a very quick run through to some of the most important roles of the heart. 